Okay, I got cut off. Sorry. Um, okay, I was about the tentacles. Yeah, the the satanic kind of Satan worship or Lucifer or whatever you want to name because I don't. I've never seen these beings or these entities or these godlike uh, beings, shall we say. I had never have seen them, okay, so I'm going to be perfectly honest. I know they exist. I see the results of their presence and I see glimpses of them everywhere, you could say, but I've never actually laid proper eyes on them. Now, but what I am saying is there are people, human people that worship these things on the planet and they are the tentacles or the offshoots I was saying of the more powerful um, beings, the true um, god-like uh, entities that control things. Now these are all just names so this is where it gets confusing and like I say I don't really know myself not having ever been one of your people that's been abducted by aliens or beings or any of this sort of stuff so I'm not one of those sort of people at all but what I am saying is that it doesn't really matter because the, the, the that kind of worship even on this earth is an extension of something bigger you know it's like the um the indirect way that we uh, worship or operate on this earth for the true controller, shall we say, the true God-like entity. Now, I say God-like because God is like, the concept of God is something that controls, something that uh, creates. Now, that's another area where I differ, but at the same time, the being does create but only creates in the sense that we give them the creation. They are not the, they are not really uh, creators in an original sense, shall we say. They manipulate what we create. They use what we give them, and and that's our world. You know, they don't directly create on this earth because they're not only not here, but they also just don't do that because. They are technical beings. Technical beings do not create so much. They manipulate and they control and they operate, but they don't actually usually, um, they don't usually go down to the beach and make a sandcastle, shall we say. That's a human kind of uh, way of doing things. That's a human creative type thing. They would just see the sand and they would you know, only create after the sandcastle is there. They don't directly create is what I'm saying, okay? But um, I think that I will finish off because to tell you the truth, the mind parasites are operating full, full force here on me right now in the sense that I had the frame of mind to be talking about a certain thing, but... The thoughts have now gone and others come in. This is because I, like most people, are not at a high frequency, so my concentration is not good. And that means that the parasites, the entities that control things, can come in and put a negative thought or even block a thought. They basically can interrupt your thinking. This is why I say we do not control this world at all. We used to a long, long, long time ago, but I think that now, and I would say that since we now have so much technology around the planet, I am guessing that that means that they have even more of an invitation and a means and a way to infiltrate the human mind. Now, I, I am talking about using a computer and a mobile like I'm using now. Now, I'm not sure 100% at this stage whether me using the mobile right now means that the thought can come in or, and I believe it's both, 
they can still come in if you're in a low frequency, low mood, as I've said, um, without it. But either way, we've got many, we're inviting them in in many ways now. Now, as I've said before, they are, they are not friendly. Now, if you think they are, if you want to, if you, if you met one tomorrow, as we have, I think, in the distant past, and that was our mistake, we thought they were friendly, we looked up to them, we admired them, they impressed us. And, you know, their technology is very, very advanced. And humans have very small technology and they are not advanced. They should be advanced spiritually, but that also has been kept from us. So we are lowly advanced technologically and spiritually. If we were advanced at a high level as we were meant to be spiritually, the Archon Parasites would be no match for us. We would take them down very quickly, but we are not. So they can take us down quickly, which is what they do. So they manipulate and control us now. This is the problem. If we were at high frequency, high level of emotional um, energy type of thing. It's very hard for me to explain it because I have not experienced it either. I, Like most of you, I experienced the low. Now, I believe that if we could get to the high frequency, there are some humans that perhaps have accomplished this, not very many, then we would open up all our abilities because I believe that we do have more abilities. These abilities are now totally suppressed and non-existent for us because we do not have access to them. We don't know they exist anyway. That's another thing too. We, we don't believe that we have abilities. We don't believe we have supernatural abilities of any sort. We believe we are what we are here and now only in the physical. We don't think that our mind can create anything and we don't think that our mind can extend to where we have many more physical and mental abilities. We certainly do not believe that we can go anywhere except in the world that we have. We do not think our mind could go into another realm, shall we say. Um, I'm suggesting that we originally were supposed to and should have been able to, but we got tricked into this belief, shall we say, that we are a limited human type thing that has, and we do have limited lifespans and things now because of our interaction with the technical beings. They limited us. They did not expand us. We went with them in the belief that we would expand. Instead, we were limited, um, as we will always be by technology. Technology is the opposite of what we are. Technology is not for our growth or our expansion. It limits us. We unfortunately believe the opposite of this and this is why we are going down. But the technology is the instrument of the beings that control the world. They have went that way in a big way 